What's up, guys? Got John here today. Hold on, guys. Uh, 2016 Honda CRV for an oil change and an oil filter. All right. Special edition. Special edition Honda CRV. What you gotta do first, what I like to do, is a maintenance minor system in all these Hondas, especially the newer ones from like 2000 up. Which is right here. It says A16. A is your primary, which is an oil change and an oil filter. Then one would be rotation and six would be diff service for only cars that are all-wheel drive or rear-wheel drive, like the S2000. What you do to reset it, you hold it down for about four seconds or five. I think now. <laughs> Once it blinks, you hold it down again. Let go and hold it down. Then it would be set to 100%. Now, the maintenance minder, it actually does not go by mileage. It goes by how you drive. Like you're driving fast, rough, going crazy with it, it's gonna be fucking shitty. But if you're doing good driving, like cruising, it'll go down slower. Essential tools for this, Hondas are the easiest cars to freaking work I get an oil filter wrench, 3 8 ratchet. An extension, you, you don't have to use an extension, but I do. And then a cup, you can buy you that snap on for like 12 bucks or even all his own, same price. Blade clean to clean it off afterwards, a couple rags, 17 millimeter wrench, and then a flash as you can see where you're doing. All right, see so your oil filters right here, easy as can be. Drain plugs right over here. Just tap it on real quick like that. Sometimes it gives you some trouble. Just give it a little turn. Twist it off lightly. Usually it drains out and it comes in. Easy, Easy to get to. Yeah, wow. Literally. Filters right there. Filters right there. And then the washer, if it doesn't come off, you don't, you shouldn't reuse these, but you can. As long as there's no cracks. Or divots inside it. You see the oil, it's pretty, pretty dirty. This is my girlfriend's car, so she drives a lot. She drives a lot of miles. It's a good thing about doing this in your driveway. <laughs> your dad will kill you. <laughs> what you could use to get this wash off, you could probably just twist it off. Or you can get a pair of dykes, which I don't have because I forgot to bring them with me. And just re-ink it off. Just cut it off. But it looks like I'm going to be reusing this washer because the thing ain't coming off. Let it drain out. And then you put the washer back in. And the drain plug. It does get dirty. This is why I always bring wax. Tighten it by hand first. Now it'll be 17. Do a nice little push, or you can even pull it. But I, I usually just do it like this so you don't over tighten. Nice and snug. No cracks, no nothing. This car's pretty much brand new. It's only got 13,000 miles on it. And then this is my favorite part. This is where it gets messy. Then you take the oil filter wrench. Make sure it's on the off position, which means loose. I'm already tired you to let the goosey for your car heads that are watching this video. Twist it off lightly. Now what I like to do Just keep this, you want to keep it right under it because it's going to spill all over the thing, please. Lightly twist it off, let it drain out a little bit so you don't get your hands dirty. Let it go out a little bit more. And this is where the red is coming in. Take it off. Mm 
Gonna drain out more. Yep, in the rag. That's your old oil filter. See all the old oil, sludgy. Still some more left in there. Where's my freaking filter? Now the filter I got, which is basically the same as a Honda filter, is Wix. Basically the same thing. Fits like it is. A little bit, little bit smaller. Get some oil on there so you don't freaking ruin it. Make sure that the washer, which is the rubber washer right here, on the filter, doesn't stay on there. If it stays on there, you put it on here with this, it's gonna be double. It's gonna cause it to leak. I work. I used to work on Honda, so I've seen this happen before. Not to me, but to a coworker. Now you don't twist. You only twist these on by hand. You don't need to wrench it on. You don't need to do anything like that. I'm pretty sure if you've done oil changes before, you know what I'm talking about. Why is this shit going on? Watch me get the freaking oil filter. Nah, I think that Wix one is. Yeah, it's probably the same side. But it's not freaking twisting on. That's something in the wrong freaking. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. No, it's twisting on. You gotta play with it sometimes. Get the rain so you don't freaking screw yourself up. Like I said, just twist it on by hand. And that's basically your oil change right there. And then what I like to do, get some brake clean. You can get this at any order parts place. Clean it off. It does smell like shit and it will kill you if you just keep sniffing it in. Now these six CRVs, also the Accords, come with a CVT transmission. Sucks, but it still works. All these cars are taking 0 20. Yep, 0 20. Nice and tight. Yep. Come up to the motor. 